Thank you for watching this DJI tutorial video. This video will discuss lens calibration and give you some shooting tips for your Zenmuse X5 camera. Lens calibration. Why do X5 lenses need calibration? Before using manual focus for the first time, lens calibration will allow you to quickly switch to infinity focus. Calibration allows you to focus in-app more effectively. When should I calibrate my lenses? After switching lenses. After initial calibration, if objects aren't in focus after pressing the infinity button or manually switching to infinity focus, please recalibrate. Please calibrate Zenmuse X5 lenses when using them for the first time. It is recommended to calibrate using distant objects after takeoff. Zenmuse X5 Lens Calibration Steps Power on the remote controller in the aircraft. Open the DJI GO app and enter the Inspire One's camera interface. You will be prompted to calibrate the lens when using manual focus for the first time. Make sure to switch to autofocus before calibrating. Please push the AF-MF button on the top right corner of the video downlink interface. When the app prompts you to calibrate the lens, please press start. Point the lens toward the horizon. Select a high contrast object at least 50 meters away in the viewfinder. Click OK and finish calibration. If you chose an object that's too close, the app will let you know. Please choose an object that's further away. Zenmuse X5 Shooting Tips When shooting landscapes using the Zenmuse X5, it is recommended to use A mode or Aperture Priority mode. On clear sunny days when light levels are sufficient, ISO can be switched to Auto mode. The recommended apertures for landscape photography are between F5 and F8. F4 through F5.6 offers the highest optical resolution for the DJI MFT 15mm f1.7 ASPH lens. You can lower the aperture if looking for a shallower depth of field. For still images taken at night, ISO should be between 200 and 800. Videos shot at night should be above 800 ISO. Low ISOs will render images finely without much noise. High ISOs will render rougher images with greater noise. Please choose an ISO according to the shooting environment and set suitable parameters for clear images. How to switch from AF to MF. Please switch the AF-MF switch on the camera to AF. Open the DJI GO app. Enter the video downlink interface. Following the previous steps, finish calibration. Click AF-MF in the top right corner to switch focus modes. Focus peaking. It is recommended to use focus peaking to obtain sharper focus. Open general settings and select focus peaking and set a percentage value. The higher the percentage, the more edges of interest will be detected and highlighted. Please choose a suitable percentage for your situation. AFMF focus assist. It is recommended to turn on AFMF focus assist for increasing the accuracy of focusing. Open the camera menu, push general settings, and turn on AF and MF focus assist. Using AF or MF to focus, the focus area on the screen will be magnified to help you focus accurately. Thank you for watching.